Hello there, Brandon Hardesty here with another No Small Parts IMDb exclusive. Actor John C. Riley, who appears in Kong Skull Island, is one of the most versatile actors around today, able to do comedy, drama, and everything in between. Riley's first film role came when he was around 24 years old in Brian De Palma's 1989 war film, Casualties of War. Right under us at this very second could be VC tunnels as far as the eye can see. After Casualties of War, he had small roles in Days of Thunder, Hoffa, and What's Eating Gilbert Grape. Then in 1996, he starred in Paul Thomas Anderson's unique thriller, Hard Eight, opposite Philip Baker Hall. Paul Thomas Anderson continued to cast him in future films like Boogie Nights and Magnolia. All of these roles had elements of comedy and drama, and Riley was perfect for them. He then surprised audiences again with his Oscar-nominated performance as Amos Hart in the musical Chicago. Should I bend my name, Mr. Cellophane? After Chicago, he continued doing drama, but got heavy into comedy, especially with Will Ferrell in Talladega Nights, The Ballad of Ricky Bobby, and of course, Step Brothers. If you were a chick, who's the one guy you would sleep with? John, John Stamos. Stamos. What? Did we just become best friends? Yup! In comedies like these, where a lot of material comes from riffing and improv, Riley showed that he was more than capable, and most importantly, in a role that not only surpasses his Oscar-nominated performance in Chicago, but perhaps any performance by anybody ever. Ringo! Dr. Steve Brühl. Steve Brühl started off as an occasional character in the fringe comedy show Tim and Eric Awesome Show Great Job. Sweet Perry Wine! <laughs> and since 2010, he he started his own series, Check It Out with Dr. Steve Brule. What's your favorite food? Pizza. He's basically a socially inept, insecure, dim-witted man-child who hosts a public access talk show. Are you ticklish? No, I'm not. Okay, uh, so go ahead and- I am, if you wanted to tickle me. And hey, his character in Kong Skull Island, who in some ways is kind of Steve Brule-esque, wears a jacket that is a direct reference to one of Steve Brule's catchphrases. For your health. Thanks for all your work, John. You may be Mr. Cellophane, but we definitely see you, and we most certainly know you're there.